Okay, so it's called A Poem About Poetry. Poetry. A lot of humans in this world find poetry dumb. I, I'm writing, I don't. I'm writing this aren't dead. Okay. Well, I feel sorry for those human beings, though most are highly stupid. I still feel sorry. There's so much variety when it comes to poetry. For example, this poem doesn't have a structure, unlike a haiku or a couplet, who has a specific structure that involves syllables or rhyme. Or an acrostic poem, you know, the one where you write, you, oh my gosh. Okay, the one where you're using a word, but while using that word, you make each letter make one line. You get me? Like the word love or your name or something super cheesy like that. Also, this poem really isn't supposed to be read on paper, like I'm supposed to read it. So, this is spoken poetry. Poetry. A lot of it involves emotion. It could be about a relationship that really sappy but still so adorable that all you can do is aw. Or a happy poem, that really fast movie poem that's possibly about Batman. <laughs> Those are my personal favorite. They have the corny jokes or the writer's weirdness just shines through, like mine is right now. Poetry. Each stanza, each line, each word means something to the writer. They're trying to say something that they don't want to say straight up. Or they're trying to teach a lesson, like how bullying affects people, or emotions, or something like that. To me, poetry, it tells a story. A story that is meant to be shared. A story that doesn't involve dialogue, paragraphs, or a summary. It tells a story about something close to us, or the writer itself. The story is about how much I used, this story is about how much I used to hate poetry. Yep, I hate poetry with a burning passion. I didn't like to write about my past or emotion. I never really thought about it. Well, I never realized true poetry. I always thought poetry was so specific. I thought it had to be a rhyme or be professional or just follow something. That lasted until the day I turned in my freshman year classes. On that yellow sheet of paper, I had German 1-2, honors geometry, freshman English, chamber orchestra, physical education, biology, and creative writing. I thought this class could help me with my stories, you know, fan fictions, you know, the typical middle school stuff. I, until I asked people actually about the class, they said I would do every type of writing, poems, like everything. I can't describe everything that's involved in writing in, what, a minute. They said, well, they said writing is different. I got home and I wrote my first real poem. I don't remember it, but I think it was about One Direction. Don't count me on it, but I was going through a weird stage in middle school. <laughs> 13 plus months later, I was the first student presenter at Writers Week 2016 as a freshman, and I've written so many other poems. I just want a chance to tell people to give poetry a chance. Get a piece of paper or, and a pencil or your laptop. All you need is a little mo emotion in yourself. And don't forget your confidence. Po and then you just have a poem. Poetry is simple, but people still don't give a shot because they're used to hearing that stupid stuff, I don't know, from the 1980s or something. That <laughs> stuff is different and compared to now. This, there's Altab, there's Slam, there's everything. There's so much variety. All I'm trying to say is just give it a shot. You won't regret it. Poetry isn't as bad as you think. To see your image dissected, chin shaped, waist clenched, your silhouette. By the lovers of guns, violence in the form of drums beat each night tomorrow. Before we go, before we check out, before we know that.